uh, important here at River City Warriors just to do some of the punch defense from the mount. I've seen a lot of different ideas out there. Uh, both these techniques come from our friends, uh, Professor Pedro Sauer and Luis Heredia, uh, who are both uh, exceptional black belts under Hickson and Helio Gracie. So uh, some pretty good stuff, I hope. So uh, one thing, if Cam is down and I'm in the mount, what he wants to do is he, he needs to have his elbows down in the middle of my thigh. If, if he crosses his arms like this, I, I saw this the other day, like punch defense like this. Yeah, maybe, but as soon as he does this, now I have an arm across the body, and if I just change my angle, it's gonna be easy to, to pin those arms. So think about it, just like boxing, you want a pillar cover side by side, and now the elbow, that's the other key detail, is in the middle. If the elbow is on the ground, I can go over the arm very easily. If the elbow is higher than the middle of my thigh, now I can do all that stuff, like cranking out the elbow, get my hips up, and now he, he can't defend himself at all. Okay, so we're gonna look at that real quick. So if Cam's above me, so he's in my mouth, I'll try to talk upside down for a while. Okay, so first thing I do, elbows are in, my partner shouldn't be able to lift them. So if he tries to lift my elbow, I anchor the opposite side foot and drop my weight. Really pick up my elbow. Can you pick it up? Nope. Nope. Okay, and I'm not even adding any other movement. He tries to go to the other side, left foot. That's it. And then I start to shrimp. See, I use my heels, a tiny little bridge. Okay? Let's say the guy's going to punch me. So I see his arm go back to punch. I'm just going to bridge. you got to try to hit me. I'm going to bridge and catch. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to catch the shoulders and glue myself to him. Now try to touch my face. Punch me. Good. See, it's so heavy. He's going to have no power. Okay, from here, I'm going to go around the head and around the arm and shift myself to the side. So now I've completely minimized the punch. That hand's going to be pretty weak. I have this control and I'm controlling his posture because what's dangerous is if he has height because now I can't reach him. And if he drops that bomb on me, I'm in trouble. So again, as soon as I see him rear back to punch, I bridge, I cover, and I check the shoulders. I prove he can't punch me and try to punch. So see how I, I stick to him? Now I go neck and arm or arm. Okay, and then from here, we won't cover this too much, but we're just gonna roll. That's it, and now I'm back in the guard, ready to escape or punch him. All right, good job. Cool.